today, the going gets a bit tougher as the Davenport Panthers bring a top 20 defense to Memorial Stadium. The Saints look to get back to 500 today on the USF Sports TV Network. Three wide receivers, two off to the left. They give to Jordan right up the middle, try to get his offensive line. Nice secondary push, and looks like that's enough for a first down. Another third down conversion for USF. Right of the line is Jordan Mixon. They're going to play action, look to throw. Firing into the end zone for Ruffin, one on one. Oh, ah! takes, it away. takes it away, Brandon Ruffin. Unstoppable one on one and another touchdown. Brandon, one on one, you're throwing in the ball. Let's see if you push it off at the end. Just a little bit. Uh, not really. And his hands on him, but I wouldn't say he pushed off. He just went yeah. up and he's he's simply taller than nice the catch. quarterback. Nice catch. Brandon Ruffin. Sixth touchdown. His 11th catch of over 20 yards. Safety's not helping out. They're going to go to Brandon. Another long opportunity. The ball dies, makes an adjustment. That's actually Zach Marino with a huge play at a 35-yard line and a first down. He had trips on the top side. He had two coverage down here on the bottom side. Again, St. Francis wide receiver do a great job of high point that ball and coming back. Watch, we had trips on the top side. He'll take the single coverage on the right side. Ball flutters against the wind, but watch him come back for that ball. Fight, 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 and now we have position <laughs> as we go down for enough for the first down. Snap, they're going to go to Brandon. Oh, no, I'm sorry. They're going to go on the out route to Lexus. It's oh, going to be real I close to a know. first down. I don't think so. Oh, they give it to him. First down by a hair. Kraus in the shotgun. Going to give to Grist. Not a lot of room. Nice pursuit by that St. Francis defense. That's going to go for a loss of three, maybe even four. Yeah, they are going to just pooch kick it. Angle kick will go out of bounds at about the 45 yard line or so. 350 to go, 21 to 7. Try Jordan again between the tackles and he finds some room and there's a lot of room up the left side. Cuts back up the 30. Still on his feet, two blockers left, ahead of him. Left, they ball him down, touchdown. Jordan Smith goes 56 yards on the ground with a lot of help from his buddies. And the Saints with it a touchdown with three minutes to go. That was all him. That was all vision. That's a great job by the offensive line. Watch this. He doesn't get touched until the second level. Arm tackle. I'm screaming go left. He does a nice job <laughs> cutting back right. But watch. There's nobody there. Oh, he just followed Ruffin. Look at Ruffin. Push that guy down. Gives him enough for a touchdown. That's a great job of downfield blocking by the wide receivers from St. Francis. Kickoff is going to be knocked down by the wind. The ball will it's bounce. A light ball, it's a light ball. Francis could jump on this. None of the Davenport upbacks decided to catch the ball. Has there been an official indication yet? Yeah, St. Francis. Yes, St. Francis gets it. How about that for a turn of events? Quarterback backs off. No blitz, but a short route to Brandon. He makes one move and picks up a first down for St. Oh, that's a late hit. He Play action from Bob Dottie. Throws into the end zone for Lexus. Can he make a play in the ball? He's up. Got it. Touchdown. Good ball. And out fights this man. Watch. Dottie puts it up there. And watch how he comes back. This football out leaves his man. Yep, he's in bounds. That's a touch. Big break for St. Francis starting this third quarter. Just the second receiving touchdown of the season for Lexus Jackson. Snap's good, holds down. Grayson Barnett's kick is good. We are knotted up here in Joliet. 21 all. He's in motion. Looking to throw. Pump fakes there, looking down the middle of the field. Nothing there. And here comes the pressure. Down he goes. Making the play in the backfield. Colian Leverson, the sack. Most quarterbacks have a time clock in their head. He's got to know, he doesn't have enough time to get this ball off. Gives Leverson a chance to break through the tackle and make that play for a sack. Third down and eight. Second down and easy to third and long. Nice play. Donnie's going to keep it. He picks up a first down. Hold on to the ball. He gets absolutely rocked. Snap to Crown's play action. He's going to look down the field. Yes, that ball. He goes. Tim Smith in the backfield. His fourth sack of the season. And what Krause does, he locks on receiver. He doesn't really see. Smitty coming through here. Watch. It's an 
inside move, and by the time he recognizes it, it's a sack. 17th sack of his career puts him at third place all time, right behind Brian Barnes and Jeff Casella. He overtakes his old teammate Albert Cruz on the sack chart. They get him down in the backfield. Smith Tim again. Smith again. A tackle for a loss for Tim Smith. Boy, he just fights off this block. Watch this. He just fights off this block. Head traits. And right now, he just beat his left hand. That is the eighth tackle behind the line of scrimmage for Tim Smith this year. One more time. Third down. They're going to throw it. Nice one-handed grab the middle of the field. Guess who made the tackle? Tim Smith was there to take Courtier down. Fourth down and long. Do you know where he came from to make that tackle? <laughs> Could you have a better three plays in a row? Holy cow. Watch where he comes to make this tackle. Watch where he comes from the, the right defensive end spot to make that tackle. Buck is to throw on first down. They're going long to Ruffin. It's in the air. On a dime to Ruffin. 20, 10, 5, touchdown. Flag on the play. Illegal man downfield. How could it be a legal man downfield on a pass play on a bomb <laughs> to the left side? You get three yards, wow. you get three yards pass the line of scrimmage, and you're still good. Are you kidding me? That was what? A quick step and throw? There's no way an offensive lineman got downfield on that. Wow, 86 yard touchdown to Ruff and wiped off the board by an ineligible man downfield. Could you throw a prettier pass in there? Oh, that was a, a funny pass. Let's let's see. They're all going backward. Where, where's the illegal man downfield? One, two, three, four, five offensive linemen. Where, where is that guy? Where's the penalty? Throws in. Oh, Intercepted by Woodard. No! Josh Woodard with 13 seconds to go. Down the sideline. He the line. Nine seconds to go. Pick of the season for number 11. Hugs all around. A field goal ices this game for the Saints. Watch it. He just undercuts that route ball throw behind. Boy, I thought he had a cowboy down the right side. Breaks it up inside. It's knocked out of bounds. Now, how much time? Nine seconds? Four and a half seconds remain on the clock. Grayson Barnett to give the Saints the lead. I don't say win because it will be a kickoff. I would imagine. Snap good. Hold down kick. It is good. And there's a flag on the play. It's going to be against Davenport. Grayson Barnett with the go ahead kick. 1.3 seconds to go. Here we go. Final play of the game. They're going to throw it short. Fumble Ruski is on. Saints jump on it. And that's the ball game. Saints upset Davenport 24-21.